this weekend we are basing ourselves at Lake Boga, which turns out to be absolutely stunning. I had no idea it was just such a lovely place. But now we're actually on our way to Goshen and we're going to go and see if we can find some birds there. Well, Goshen's quite a renowned and significant uh, site for Victorian bird watchers because you can see quite a few uh, dry country birds here without going all the way further to, to um, Hadar or, or Wyberfeld. Well, I can already say this is better than last time. Uh, there's a few more flies, but the mosquitoes are just not really doing anything. And the birds are already really active, so it's interesting. And we'll see what we can find. This is so much better than last time. This is fantastic. It's actually really nice. When we were here last time, I just thought it was just horrible. And this time, being late afternoon and not being in, like just attacked by mosquitoes, uh, it's actually really pretty. And there's some really pretty plants here and the birds are lovely. So um, I'm really glad we came. So this is one of these abandoned houses. It's the only one I've actually seen so far, but I think there's more. Right, so we think this might be the tennis courts. Welcome, welcome to Goshen. Anyone for tennis? Yeah, there's one in the tree. Yeah, one. There's one there. Just on the um, dead, one of the low branches of the dead tree. Yeah, that's the female white white browed wood swallow. Okay. Um, the male was hawking around here as well. We might get close enough to get some shots. Can you see it? Yeah. Yeah. as well. They're there around, just two of them. So it's all happened. Oh, there she goes. Oh, there's another one. Now what's that? And that's a mast wood swallow. One of the reasons that the uh, Goshen is such a special spot for Victorian birders is 
partly because of this stuff, Eremophila longifolia. Um, and this is a nectar source for certain honey eaters and uh, including nomadic uh, rare honey eaters or rare for Victoria such as the black honey eater and the pied honey eater. So in certain years, particularly hot dry years actually, um, the black and pied honey eaters come down south from inland Australia into Victoria and one of the spots they come to is Goshen. But it's actually been such a cold wet <laughs> spring when I actually expected to see them but plenty of other birds around. Jumping. It's amazing what you see sometimes. These are carp and the floodwaters around here I guess they are have moved into an area where they've got lots of food. Uh, it's quite shallow here and the carp are just having the best time. <laughs> 